Welcome to the Nine News Prep Rally. Here's Taylor Temby. Some very notable athletes have come out of Una Vista over the years. Mason Finley still holds the National High School discus record and has a bronze medal from the 2017 Track and Field Championships. Then there's Matt Hemingway, who won the silver medal in the high jump back in the 2004 Summer Olympic Games. And finally, Nate Solder, a former University of Colorado All-American. The two-time Super Bowl winner played his high school days at the next stop in our Fanscape series. <laughs> I think because we're here in it all the time, we don't even understand that. But I think people really enjoy coming here and playing in the atmosphere and the surroundings. There's a valley 120 miles south of Denver on Highway 285. No matter which direction you look, you look at some 14,000 foot peak. The Arkansas River rushes along one side of the Buena Vista home football stadium. On the other side, of, of course, you have Mount Princeton. That's my, my favorite mountain for sure. Oh, have you hiked it many times? <laughs> <laughs> no, I've thought about it a lot, so I don't know if that counts. Mount Princeton may be a ways off, but the demons have climbed to the top of Colorado's high school football peak before. From any age, from the youngest to the old that are wheeling in or, or whatnot, and it's just really cool, and they have a lot of pride in this this school and this town and, and uh, this field. Twice, they've brought a state title back home to the town of Buena Vista. I think the community support uh, that we get is phenomenal. To a devoted and passionate fan group, one that will do anything for its players. The community has always really supported athletics here and, and they get behind that and they support the young people being involved in athletics, all sports. That was on full display during the 1A state championship game in 2015. The night before, more than 10 inches of snow buried the Demons Field. Saturday morning, dozens from the Greater Buena Vista community showed up with their shovels and kickoff went on as scheduled. I think the influence of the community and, and even their parents. Despite the elevation, Buena Vista High School is grounded. There's a lot of people that have, have grown up here and are raising their kids here and, and uh, they probably hear about it and they probably spent a lot of time here as a, as a little kid running around and, and watching the games and knowing you know, how cool of an environment this is. There's a sense of pride and loyalty around the athletics program and it all converges here under the valley's brightest lights. And I do think we're reminded of that when other teams end up coming here. Um, even during our summer camps and stuff, we'll have team camps here, other teams are coming in and you'll just hear them, you know, with that wow factor and, and you'll actually start looking around and, and yeah, you start to appreciate it um, all over again. Who's ready for the fall season? The Buena Vista Demons kick off their season September 6th. Many others around the state start next Friday. And you can find everything you need by visiting our website, 9news.com slash HSS.